in these problems we're being asked to express one trig function in terms of its co-function. So what does that mean? What's a co-function of a trig function? Well, you may have noticed that some of these trig functions look an awful lot alike. For example, here is sine x in red, and here is cosine x in blue. They are basically the same shape, just pushed over pi over 2 units. So here's where cosine of x equals 1, pi over 2 units later, sine of x equals 1. And the same relationship holds for all the points along these curves. So if we wanted to express you know, sine of, um, of pi over 2, we could just subtract pi over 2 from it and say, oh, that's the same thing as the cosine of 0. And that's what you're doing when you're finding one value in terms of the co-function of another. So this chart may help a little bit. It's pretty simple, the process here. All we're going to do, if we're, uh, we've are we got the sine of something, we're going to take the cosine of that thing subtracted from pi over 2. Let's try that up here. So we're going to start with pi over 2, and we're going to subtract pi over 8 from it. Let's see. We can make pi over 2 into 4 pi over 8. That's the same as pi over 2. So 4 pi over 8 minus pi over 8 that equals 3 pi over 8. So what that means is the sine of pi over 8 is the same thing as the cosine of 3 pi over 8. And we have expressed sine of pi over 8 in terms of its cofunction, the cosine. Let's try another one. This one says use a cofunction to write an expression equal to secant of 5 pi over 11. Well, the cofunction of the secant is the cosecant. The cofunction of tangent is cotangent and vice versa. Um, but with the secant, we're looking at the cosecant. The process here is the same, though. We're going to take pi over 2 and subtract 5 pi over 11. Now, let's see. We can't express pi over 2 in 11ths very easily. So I'm going to convert all of these to 20 seconds. So pi over 2 is 11 over 22 sorry, 11 pi over 22, and 5 pi over 11 is the same as, whoops, we just want subtraction there, not an equal sign. So 5 pi over 11 is 10 pi over 22. Aha, so we're getting 1 pi over 22 as our answer here. So the secant of 5 pi over the 11 is the same as the cosecant of pi over 22. So that is how to express one trig function in terms of a cofunction.